Are well, you I'm... a principal? Did I hear that? Patrice Johnson is an assistant principal. Husband Michael is a youth minister. This hardworking couple says they've been ideal tenants at the Coach House Apartments the last four years. It was good and we got comfortable and um, then things started to change. The Johnsons say previous ownership kept lease records online and they couldn't get copies. So this summer, when California-based Landmark Realty bought the complex, the couple says they were told there was no lease on file. They'd need to re-sign. Don't worry, we're not going to raise your rents or anything. That's what she said, and, uh, <laughs> and it didn't work that way. The family says they're now facing an extra $328 a month to stay. It's baffling. They're not alone in their complaints about Landmark. It keeps me up at night. I can't sleep. This fall, we introduced you to the family of this Kansas City firefighter facing threats of eviction at the same complex. Landmark Realty is also now the target of a new federal class action lawsuit. It alleges the company used deceptive practices to wrongly withhold fees from tenants. Back at Coach House, the Johnsons say they're looking to move out. I have a business background, so I know it possibly could be just business, but it's not ethical. 